On Wednesday, Bolivia's the former de facto government minister, Arturo Murillo, was sentenced in the United States to seven years in prison for the crimes of international bribery and money laundering. The court announced the sentence after finding conclusive proof of the millionaire overpricing in the purchase of tear gas in 2019. Murillo pled guilty, as did the rest of his accomplices involved in the case. For its part, the Bolivian government initiated a civil lawsuit before the United States courts against Murillo and his accomplices to recover the money employed in the tear gas purchase, which amounts to $2.3 million, in addition to preparations and reparations for the damages. The government of Bolivia also said this is the largest conviction in the history of the country.